Well, hey, how's it going? Thanks for watching my video. So, playing with another mod, of course we are. This mod is uh, another one that's pretty much based on social interactions. Made a little family, they've just moved in, which is why their house is a little bit empty. But I'm excited because I'm hoping with this mod we will have a hell of a lot of drama. So just to introduce you to the family, pretty small, there's only four people. There's uh, Juliet and Sean, they're married. They have a son called Jason, and then they have a nanny here called Catelyn. And if all goes to plan, we should be having quite a few bust-ups, and I think Catelyn might just overstep her mark, but we'll see. First off, though, I will show you the mod I'm going to be using. So this is the mod we're going to be using, Contextual Social Interactions. Haven't used it before, but I do use a lot of mods by this creator and I'm always impressed. So pretty confident this is going to go well. It gives you new interactions based on uh, performance at work, pregnancy, death, divorces and breakups and cheating. So let's flip back over to the game. So I'm thinking, first of all, let's get the dad a job, try and get him like fired or something. We really want to see this family hit rock bottom. That's the entire reason why they were made. <laughs> they were created to suffer. Uh, fuck it, put him in the business career. Bit boring, but he's a boring guy. Let's take a look at their sentiments right now. The uh, husband and wife. Oh, sweethearts. Oh, nice. Well, you know what I might do? I want to try and send Juliet out. Need to get rid of her for a few hours. So maybe I'll send her jogging. And then I'm going to use a little bit of MC Command Center to improve the dad's relationship with the nanny. Oh, this is going to be good. True loves. He loves the nanny more than he even loves his wife. Right, see you later, Juliet. Have fun. Is she gone? Well, she's at least out the house, so let's get this first kiss out of the way. Ask if Sim is supernatural. Uh, first kiss. There we go. Playing away with the nanny. That's what we like to see. She is earning her salary. Okay, woohoo with the nanny. I think Juliet is still on her run, right? Yep, yeah, she's still at the house. Great, great. How's the kid feeling? He seems complete. Yeah, he's happy. <laughs> his dad's cheating on his mum, but he's just really happy because he's just had some lemonade. Shit, she's coming back. That wasn't a very long... Oh, wait, is that her? Oh, no, it's not her. It's just some random stranger helping themselves into our house. You want to mug us as well while you're here? Sims, man. They just don't give a shit, do they? The kids got dressed in a little tuxedo. <laughs> Why? Maybe he, he thought, well, seeing as you guys are busy, I'll go and entertain the guests for the welcome wagon. That is a cute kid. Starting to feel a little bit guilty about ruining his life. All right, guys, wake up, wake up. Okay. <laughs> His first interaction, he's autonomously gone to go and kiss his wife. No, don't do that. Don't do that. That's not a good idea. You could gush about your partner. I feel like it'd be quite funny if they're all just sat around the dinner table and the nanny just starts blowing kisses to the husband. Now, I wonder if I click on them, if I get a new pie menu. I don't think so with this one. I think this one is literally just a couple new interactions. I think that's it. I wonder if he can even, like, confess to cheating. Yeah, that's right, guys. Probably is for the best if you take this outside. Gossip about office romances. <laughs> okay, I don't seem to have the option for him to just come out and admit to cheating. So instead, I'm just going to have the nanny come on over and just <laughs> show Juliet what's been going on. If she's paying attention. Oh, yeah, Juliet, seen it. She's kicking off. She's kicking off. She's very angry from a flirty spouse. Well, not quite flirty, but full-on cheating. I feel like I might have to get them to kiss just to really rub it in, really drive home what's going on here. Yes, <laughs> she's kicking off again. Is she going to slap him? Yeah. Because that's the way you solve problems, is violence. Ask what Sean's problem is. Criticise woohoo techniques. Okay, so we had a little bit of a hiccup. My game crashed and decided not to save anything, but that's okay. The family's back, although they, may look, they might look slightly different. But we still got the drama. Look at that face. She's not impressed, is she? And they just keep, they keep going. Frenzied kiss. 
Yeah, go for a frenzy kiss. I want to see what that looks like. <laughs> she wanted to give him a kiss, and then the other girl kissed him. Stay where you are. I'm coming to give you a kiss. Are you going to go give him a frenzied kiss? Huh? I think she is going to give him a frenzied kiss. Or sarcastic compliment. <laughs> is that what a frenzied kiss is? Just to slap around the chops? Okay, I think let's get divorced. I criticise woohoo techniques. <gasps> Juliet is divorcing Sean. Oh dear. It's official. They're divorced. I wonder how he feels about it. Oh, he's very sad. Why don't you come talk to your new girlfriend about it? Talk to her about how sad you are. Express regrets over separation. That's the new interaction that came with this, uh, this mod. I don't know if that's a good idea, though, because she's your new girlfriend, so... She's telling the kid to shut up. You're supposed to be this kid's new stepmom. You're not the nicest. <laughs> she doesn't seem to mind too much that he regrets separating. There should be another option as well. Oh, yeah, trash X. Trash that bitch. She was so mean, splitting up with us for having a cheeky cheat. Maybe you guys should just woohoo after, that might make you feel a bit better. He's gone straight from sad to flirty. Feeling regrets from expressing regrets. Oh, hang on, got a little mood buff there. As he was telling another sim about it, Sean truly realised how much he regrets breaking up with his former significant other. It seems like the right thing to do at the time, but now, not so much. The mum doesn't really have anyone to talk to. She could talk to the kid. She could trash her ex to the kid. <laughs> Tell him how much of a little fuck his dad is. Express regrets over separation. Trash ex. Go and trash his dad. Tell him about how much of a dirt bag his, dirt bag his dad is. Oh, bless her. Yeah, she's trashing him right now. <laughs> he doesn't want to hear it. Aw, she can denounce friendship with her own kid. Bit harsh. Now, I know you get new interactions if you get fired from your job or if you get a promotion. I wonder if there's anything if he quits his job. Quit job. So I wonder if he has any new interactions for quitting his job. No, it seems like everything is just overshadowed by his recent divorce. Let's have a look at the notes a second. So, yeah, I think usually you get, like, a sad mood buff for someone if someone's been fired or demoted. And then you get a happy one if they've been promoted. And then you also get some stuff with a dead sim. You can compliment or criticise woohoo technique, trash X, express regrets over separation, talk about baby names. Maybe I should just kill one of them. Why not? See what happens. I'm half tempted to kill the nanny. And then that way maybe the divorce sims might get back together. <laughs> Be slain by a vicious killer rabbit. There we go. You can be killed by a rabbit. Oh no. She's dying. The wife really doesn't mind. She's pretty happy. She looks a bit shocked, but... Alas, Jamie Sparks incurred the wrath of a vicious killer rabbit and now death awaits her. What a cruel fate. Well... She did sort of overstep the mark a little bit. She didn't deserve to die, but she did overstep the mark when it comes to her job responsibilities. Now, I might just improve the married couple's relationship again. They're such a roller coaster, these two. Just because I want to see if they can interact with each other about the, uh, the situation where, with the death. Discuss having witnessed death. Yeah. Trash X. <laughs> <laughs> Discuss witnessing the death and then trash him. Console about death. Oh, even the Grim Reaper is crying. Maybe, maybe our nanny was a bit friskier than we thought. Maybe she got around. Maybe the Grim Reaper is one of her ex-loves too. Reminisce about the departed. Oh, that was fun. I think I'm going to end this video here because... I think this is one of those mods where you really get the most out of it after you've been playing it for hours. And I don't want to take away some of the fun. So we looked at a couple new interactions. But uh, yeah, that was the contextual interactions mod. I will leave a link to it in the video description if you'd like to download it yourselves. But otherwise, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.